Hello everyone. This morning we're going to be talking about five tips for new players getting started in my time at Porsche. The game is still in early access, so things can and will probably change, but these pointers should still be valuable even after the game is released. First, you can place furniture in your house to grant you additional stamina. The amount of stamina you can get is based on the size of your house and how much furniture you have, but at the start of the game you can have a maximum of 50 bonus stamina. The easiest way to do this is to hang your builder's license on the wall for a nice bonus of 20 stamina and then build some stone furniture. Stone stools are worth 2 stamina and stone tables are worth 7. Usually I try to have 4 stone tables and a stool set up for 30 total stamina plus 20 from the builder's license to max out at 50. I try to do this by the end of the first few days. As I get more resources, I like to replace these with couches and other furniture to make my house look nice. But in the early game, it's more important to max out with that plus 50 bonus stamina. Second, make sure you eat food from the restaurant every day. You can travel to the restaurant just inside the main gate and eat once per day. And you can restore up to 80 stamina by paying 40 gold for a meal. This is the biggest and cheapest chunk of stamina restoration in the game, and you should use it every day in the early game to maximize how much you can get done in a day. After a couple of weeks, you'll have more stamina and fewer demands on it so it becomes less important, but at the start of the game, the extra stamina can really come in handy. You can steal from Higgins at the start of each day. Run over to the furnaces outside of his workshop at the beginning of the day, and you'll find one to two copper or bronze bars waiting for you. This is a big help getting your first tools in the first couple of days, and it adds up if you do it every day through the first spring, saving several days worth of time on your furnaces. Speaking of furnaces, having multiple furnaces active early is helpful to getting the huge amounts of metal you'll need for those big commissions in the first spring. I recommend building two stone furnaces on the first day, adding a third one shortly after, and adding a civil furnace as soon as you have it unlocked. With four furnaces, you'll have plenty of metal, glass, stone bricks, and charcoal for all of your construction. This also applies to other equipment. I usually do two cutters, two skivers, and one grinder in the first spring to make sure I have all the production I need for a new commission each day, as well as the big quest commissions. The last tip is to start on the data disk research as soon as possible. You're going to need a ton of copper ore to do all the crafts you need in the first spring, and while you mine that ore, you'll get plenty of data disks. You can take five data disks to Petra at the research center to unlock new recipes every few days. If you start this as soon as possible, and keep it going constantly, you'll always have the crafting schematics you need right when you need them. I usually don't find that it's worth it to pay the extra data disks to speed along the process of researching new schematics, but your mileage may vary. Thanks for watching. If you have any additional tips, feel free to leave them in the comments below. Be sure to hit that like and subscribe button.